Okay, we've pieced in these pieces. We've done some work to uh, shave off little parts, little bits, get this all to fit real nice together. This is what will be the front of the cockpit combing coming up here. We've got this all uh, beveled in, wire tied. The other side fits in nice and tight. And then we put in these two side pieces that come from that first yoke up in the front, come back to the rear deck. And what I've done is taken uh, and butt blocked these. I laid the, the long strips down there. Well, first I had to fare them into the, the uh, shear panel, but then uh, laid them on top, just took a pencil underneath the existing uh, rear deck and, and forward yoke and uh, cut those out on the bandsaw. I got a real nice tight fit and then I just, I've uh, I got little butt blocks, little piece of plywood underneath there to to uh, glue those together. So we've got them on both sides and uh, we've got a pretty nice fit there. So I'm pretty happy about that. Now that big oval that we were looking at earlier, still sitting over on top of the haven over there, that uh, that then now will mate up with and fit on top of, of this and give it a nice clean look. So uh, came back in the back and untied all the ties, beveled, sanded, um, planed, did whatever we needed to to get these to to butt up nice and tight and, and I'm, I'm real happy with some of that. That's just, uh, we're getting a real nice fit. So that's going to make for a nice looking deck. Okay, we are now at a point with the with this uh, double duck kayak that we're trying to spot weld these seams. Everything's all tied together with the copper wire. We got it straight, we got it fair the way we want it. And I'm using this um, Total Boat Thixo. It's a epoxy that mixes as it comes out of this caulking gun. It's got this special little mixing nozzle. And uh, it puts out a really nice bead. You can just put it right in there. And so I'm in hopes that that's just gonna uh, glue this thing together so that I can take the wires out and then and then we can put our um, fillets in and uh, this one it says has a what was it 30 35 minutes so but I'm sure as long as it's still in the tube here we're okay um, and we've got a lot of seams to do so I think um, we should have hopefully we'll have enough here we've got another one of these if we need it um, so anyway, we're going to make sure we don't glue this one in. And then I am using this little stick, just a little epoxy mixing stick to, um, just any place where I like kind of jump like there, I jumped off the, out of the crack just a little bit. I'm trying to stay out of these, um, off the wires because I want to pull the wires out. So anyway, thanks to Total Boat for this. We're going to see how this works, and it looks, looks pretty good. I like the way it's coming out of the tube. So. More as we get this glued up. Okay, still gluing with this Thixo from uh, Total Boat. And uh, you can see what fine beads I'm getting in there. The, uh, the nozzle on this, this mixing nozzle, just fantastic. Um, you can get in really cramped spaces. Like, I wasn't sure exactly how I was going to get up here in the bow. I'm in my own light. Um, I'm able to put this nozzle right down in there. I don't know if you can see that. And I've got little fine beads right down in a very tight space that I otherwise don't know how I would have got epoxy in. So, uh... That's just fantastic, and I'm able to place it exactly where I want it um, and get really close. I, I'm not touching any of my wires so far, um, and uh, 
everything's going up nice. And these places like on the, the rear bulkhead here, um, I'm able to just get right in there, get a nice fine bead and, and get those pieces of wood st stuck together. So um, anyway, I'm just real happy with this. All right, more in a little bit. All right, we're through doing these tack welds using this uh, Thixo. And uh, this is the, uh, the deck. So that one support piece down there that's rounded at the end, that's actually forward. That's uh, the aft deck bulkhead or deck frame. And these other three come out. So I was very careful not to get glue on these. But uh, one of the things I wanted to show here is, is how we uh, put the, the side pieces on this here. You can see here I got this little uh, butt joint. And uh, I did that last night just with uh, wood glue with tight bond three and then uh, I wired those to the shear panels and uh, then was able to put the glue in there so uh, this is the wood duck double and I know I keep saying that but the plans that we got left something to be desired in that they did not show this deck assembly at all so some of this we just kind of had to figure out. Got a certain amount of pieces and parts and it's not that hard to put the jigsaw puzzle together. But for somebody else who's confused or struggling to try to figure this out, I kind of wanted to make at least a fair, pretty fair documentary about what this looks like. So this is the after panel here. I'm running out of garage. Um, and then that has a two, two shear panels that attach there. And then that's a, a temporary deck frame, temporary deck frame. That's all cockpit in the middle of there. And then that's uh, the four deck up there. All right, more later. I would like to make a special note that I have called Chesapeake Lightcraft twice in the last two weeks, and they have been extremely helpful. I'd like to thank Jamestown Distributors and Total Boat and also my wife Carrie for her help with videoing and uh, hope this was helpful and thank you for watching.